Hi, everybody. Welcome back. It's February 20th, 2023. President's Day. Woohoo! Uh, you may be wondering what a concentric line is. If you haven't watched any of my previous videos, these uh, concentric lines are exactly what they sound like. They're a line that you can only see in the dark shadows. They're circular and around the uh, uh, center of the pole the line is smaller and the farther that it goes out the larger the line gets. And these lines circle the globe from top to bottom but you can only see them in the dark craters. And there's been a lot of um, uh, thoughts on exactly what these concentric lines are uh, and none of the thoughts that that I had uh, you know came out turned out to be true uh, they were only guesses and uh, and while there were some similarities in the guesses it just wasn't at all like like what I expected so as it turns out uh, what these concentric lines are and they're all different by the way they're all different so so far I think this is the only the second time that we've tried to look really really closely but uh, much to your surprise when you see a line like this uh, it's complicated looking it's very uh, strange and it looks like it must serve some sort of purpose but at the end of the day it's uh, it's buildings right buildings just like uh, everywhere else on the globe uh, literally and then and buildings just like what we see everywhere else uh, in the solar system you know lots and lots and lots of buildings and they're just packed in super tight uh, to the point where we just can't even understand at all um, what it would be like uh, to live in a place where there's no ground. Everything is just covered with buildings. And it's easy to understand why we can't realize what that would be like is because this is an alien place. This is an alien place. It's about 270,000 miles from Earth. And, uh, and it's, it's my belief that there are far, 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 far more people living on the moon than there is on Earth. Now, the pictures I'm showing you here today are consent, just a small portion of, of a concentric line. Uh, I don't know how many there are on the moon. I think I guessed one time. I'm not even going to say. It's, it's, uh, it's got to be somewhere in the neighborhood of, I don't know, uh, four or five dozen concentric lines um, I forgot the point of that but the uh, they're all different and uh, they seem like they should have a purpose but uh, I, if there is I just just don't know what it is it's uh, just like everywhere else it's just buildings and you know just like everywhere else it's not just buildings it's all about the coloration or the shading you know this uh, black and white imagery of very complicated areas like this are so so difficult to show and uh, I, I meant to mention it in the beginning of the video you know if you have a screen that's any smaller I mean I, I don't even think a uh, an iPad screen would be large enough to be able to see what it is we're looking at here um, I know sometimes when I get zoomed out, it's just this this pattern that doesn't make any sense, and you don't have to go back very far. And when it's too small, uh, it just gives you these patterns, and you, you you're not able to look into the picture to, to see what's really there. This area right here is a very busy place, and it, it once again it doesn't look anything like what you would have expected it to look like by looking at it when it's zoomed out um, that's another thing well when you're zoomed out uh, you have a definite look of what things look like but when you zoom in boy it completely changes and you just uh, it's even hard to relate what you're looking at zoomed in compared to what what it looked like when it was zoomed out 
but this particular white line has row after row after row after row of these uh, of these white buildings now when you're zoomed out it looks like a big coil right because the buildings are so close together and the angle that they are in this in the middle of this dark area but coming in close on it you can just see it's just white buildings uh, going across this this dark area diagonally it's very strange stuff that's what Herbert Klein always likes to say very strange very strange and I've tried so many different ways to to make this clearer and easier to understand I've done filters uh, it's extremely difficult to bring this uh, these images out so you can see them very very time-consuming uh, I've said before I, I uh, you know I, I hearken back to the days of the color pictures so I, I went back and I, I knew that it happened on a couple of of the uh, of the uh, color pictures I've been looking at the gigapans that uh, they had been gone back and obfuscated them. I, well, I went through all of the ones that I've used in my videos, and I'm really sorry to say they've obfuscated every goddamn one of those. I'm sorry, it makes me so angry. It's a major loss to everybody that ever wanted to look at this kind of stuff. So as far as I know, the only pictures that remain of those gigapans that are not obfuscated now are in my files and uh, I wanted to go back and and get some fresh pictures and you know there's so many things that I see now that I wouldn't see then that I could bring to you but not any longer and uh, I, I accept the responsibility for this because as far as I know I'm the only one that we're showing those pictures thanks for watching everybody hope you have a great day bye bye